Now when I walk around with this smile on my face, I know that I got the ability to change the temperature in the room when I walk in. So regardless of what I'm going through, y'all don't know that I ain't go to bed till 5 a.m. last night. Y'all don't know what I got going on in my personal life. All y'all know is when I show up, dang, that man energy was amazing. That brother showed up and he helped to make this a better experience for us all. Trash talk! Y'all, it is, what time is it? Fucking loud ass garbage truck. Oof, the light. It is 6.09 in the morning. I just got done editing. I have two alcohol marks because my barber razor and then put alcohol on afterwards. And my skin is so sensitive and I was like halfway asleep so I didn't remind him not to do it. And now I have two marks on my face, but I just got done editing. I am so thirsty and I'm so snacky, but I brush my teeth. So unfortunately, I can't have anything. But my skin is still moisturized and my lips are still glossy. Yes. Yeah, I'm definitely, I'm definitely on the verge of insomnia and delusion. But um, the vlog will be out today. So excited for you guys to see it. I always get so excited when my vlogs come out on time because I feel like my my duty is done. Although I'm never done, but it just feels good. I just want to say if this was your first time here, I really appreciate you guys watching. I hope y'all enjoy. I hope you feel like you're a part of a family. I hope you feel like you're a part of somewhere safe and we're non-judgmental over here. As you can see, I just love to pick up this camera and <laughs> show y'all my life. You know, nothing crazy. I love my friends. I love my quality time with them. I love my time to myself as well. I love hookah. I love coffee. I love learning how to overcome obstacles and things like that. So if that's what you're into, join the family. Join the Trash Talks Nation. Okay. All right. It's about that time. It's been that time. It's been been that time. I'm going to sleep and people waking up. If I can't fall asleep within the next 30 minutes, I will be forcing myself to go to the gym. But that's neither here or there. I got to go, y'all. I love y'all so much. So, 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 so much. I hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. Please give this video a like, comment, share. Show your boy some love for real, for real. Like, really show me that you really fuck with me. All right, good night. Love y'all. Hey, Siri. Turn off flashlight. Good night. Night, night. Oh, good night, Siri. Nighty, night. Y'all, I overslept and I still made it out. <laughs> and I'm already back home. What time is it? It's 1.58. I, was, I sat in the car for like 20 minutes singing. So, I've been home. Um, I'm pretty much not gonna go to sleep because I have to be to work at 8.30. It's 2 o'clock already and I slept all day. So, I'm about to make me some hookah. Yeah. Hmm. We'll see what happens. <laughs> I may take a nap. I probably, I'm gonna actually finish Sailor Moon. That's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. Y'all, I was so sad and depressed and just confused and just lost at one point. So I started watching Ron and all my other favorite YouTubers to just get a little inspiration. And, you know, it does help because it helps me feel like I'm moving purposefully and like everything I'm doing is intentional. So I just started cleaning up and organizing stuff. I'm good. Like, it's just 
I'm very happy that I'm able to realize like, hey, you know, you got to focus and you got to lock in and you got to do what really makes you happy. So that's pretty much what I did. Edited, cleaned, did a little hookah, read some emails, and I just finished my day. Also, as you can see coming up, I danced the night away. I probably danced to like six or seven Whitney Houston songs and just had a good time. Like, I love my AirPod Pro Maxes. Like, those things are amazing. Get you a pair. Ooh. What's up, you guys? So, I hadn't picked... I look crazy. Oh, my God. Sorry. I was trying to find less ways to look crazy, but didn't come up with any. Um, it is currently... 12 15 and it is monday may 13th um i have not picked up the camera i'm gonna be honest i just i just wasn't feeling like I, I hate when like i love to be a youtuber don't i love doing this don't get me wrong but there are times when i just i'm just it's just hard like to do this you know what i mean sometimes i get nervous sometimes i get anxious um i was feeling a little insecure this week just because you know i'm still working on myself and i, I don't got all these things together um it is definitely time for a haircut and nails and i just been focusing and working on things some things in, more internally than externally so you know it, it gotta balance itself and sometimes i can't find that balance what else i just oh i recently went to someone who i who is inspiring to me um home and uh, studying tea like it is definitely like Okay, I got some work to do. <laughs> I got a lot of work to do, actually. I can't afford that. But, uh, not now. Not now. I can't afford it now. But, you know, never know. It was just very inspiring to see. You know what I mean? Like, you go into a millionaire's home and you get to just honestly do whatever you want. And I'm just like, that, uh, it, sh you sure you don't want me to move in with you? If this is your invitation for me to move in, I'm taking it. But I'm trying to get my life together. <laughs> Um, I have a package to pick up at Glossier. I gotta get some coffee first. I gotta get some gas. By the way, I still have the rental. My car is not done yet, I'm assuming. Walt tells, oh, I have to go see my friend. She wants me to help her decorate her place. And I promised her I would. She lives about an hour away, but it's okay. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna wreck it out. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. I keep my word. One thing I do, I always keep my word, even if, you know, I ain't gonna say I'm gonna be over there for hours, but I'm gonna keep my word. Get into the swing of things. I already brushed my teeth. I didn't put anything on my face yet because I just took off my pimple patches and we ain't got no pimples. So, yeah. But, yeah, I'm about to um, quickly throw something on and just chill. Well, I'm not really chilling. Get to the duties. Get to my uh, errands. So, yeah. I'm back. I don't know if you guys noticed, but... I only have one piercing. Guess what? It came out. So I have to spend more money to get another one to go through that pain again. <sighs> Not excited, but I just remember I need to probably do that right now. While I have the mindset of being in this pain and having them punctured through my nose again, because look at my skin. My skin is growing over that. I can't even like, I'm scared. I don't even want to like try to stick something through it because I don't want to hurt myself or infect myself. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not really feeling that. Um, this the shit I'm talking about. Mm. Every, every time. Can I put this up here? I'm trying to station my camera, y'all, so where it could be. That's scary. Okay, I'm gonna leave it right here for now, but I'm not driving like that. <sighs> I got an impossible burger. Burger. I hate saying burger. Impops. Oh, brother, this guy stinks. <laughs> impossible sandwich. I need not to be putting these nails in the camera like that. Okay. I gotta go get some gas, and then I gotta go get my nose repairs, and then I gotta go pick up my lip stuff, and then I gotta to Desiree House. Period. I have a plan today. Today is going to be mm, amazing. Let's get started. Sweet. 
So I did not record it, but as you can see, we got both piercings back. I am peeling a little bit, and when he pushed up, I have a little pimple popping up now. Ah, it's because my nose is stressed. My nose is stressed, but I'm about to go to Pun City Market right quick to pick up my order, and then I'm gonna head to my friend's place. Y'all, it is two o'clock in the morning. I have a haircut appointment at nine o'clock in the morning, so that means I gotta get up at eight o'clock in the morning. But I have to wash my face. I've been my skin has been feeling freaking crazy. Like <laughs> stressed. I'm stressed. I honestly don't know what this week's vlog is gonna look like because I have been, I've been struggling with this vlog, you know, tomorrow I'm going to go, I'll, I'll feel better. I'm getting a haircut. I possibly may get my nails done. I'm going to a coffee shop to film like tomorrow may really wake it up for me, shake it up for me. I know I truly may feel like a different person once I get my haircut, my skin going to clear up. Ugh, I'm tired of getting this nose piercing, so this one better stay in. Or I'll just take them out. Oh, oh. But yeah, I don't know. I've just been struggling. Everything just don't come to you when you're creative. I don't, I personally don't do a lot on my days off unless I have to. So forcing myself to do stuff is very expensive. <sighs> it's not authentic, but tomorrow I'm definitely going to have some content for you guys. We're, we're going to have a great day. We're gonna have a great day tomorrow, today, cause it's after two o'clock. So today we're gonna have a great day once I get up. I buy these weekly cause I ain't got time. I'm actually about to jump in the shower. Ow. Sorry, gotta be careful around my nose. But yeah, jump in the shower really fast. So I can't do all my skincare cause I know my face is gonna get wet in the shower. But when I get out, I definitely will be finishing with some skincare. Um, putting on my retinol. Wait, what is the setting that this thing is on? Oh, wait, what? Yeah, that, hold, hold on, hold on. Okay, that's so much better. There was like this little on my camera, but now it's gone. Okay, so that's so much better. There was like this little line going through my camera. So much better. Um, But yeah, when I get out, I'm definitely gonna put a pimple patch on this. This is actually gonna probably be a mole. That's how my moles and freckles pop up. They look like these little white things that look like pimples. And then next thing you know, it's a mole. <sighs> Again, I don't wanna do my very important skincare stuff because I'm gonna get in the shower and it's gonna get wet. But let me go ahead and oil, oil my scalp. I'm gonna use this. One, and I use the one from Sacred. Ooh, the rubber bands on my hair came off. I could feel it. My hair is hanging in there. It's gonna have to hang in, cause <laughs> I'm not getting my hair rebraided until I go out of town. So. How does the back look? It feels crazy. We gonna have to make it work. Ooh, tomorrow. Jesus, bless me with some good looks tomorrow. <laughs> Please, cause I'm looking crazy. All right, I'm about to put this do-rag on. Actually. I can't put it too low because I still got to do my skincare. 
Damn it. <laughs> yes, I have to do all this. Good night. See you guys later in the day. And yeah. Y'all, I just got my haircut and <laughs> one of the finest men and walk in for me. Not for me, but walk in. So I'm walking out and he about to walk in and um he's like holding the door for me. And I'm taking my time because I'm not noticing that somebody's holding the door for me and he's still holding the door. Probably like a good, um, no, no, no diddy, about a good 30 seconds. So I'm just like, oh, I'm sorry. And then I ran over to the door and he was like, no problem. And he is so fine. He came back outside, I guess, because he asked, were there any walk-ins? And I don't know what my barber told him, but he could walk in this place. <laughs> Ooh, he got a Genesis though. Them dumb fucking cars are so expensive for no reason. To me, that when I see somebody in the Genesis, I'm like, you just wasted. You just got money to spend. I don't know. He is fine as fuck. Oh my god, I can't even drive. That's how fine he is. Like, also because I'm waiting for the nail salon to open. I could wait outside the nail salon, but. It ain't really one of those types of like they got a garage now it's just it's a lot of work so i just decided to wait here but all right i'm gonna shut up i'm gonna shut up i'm gonna shut up i'm gonna take a food and let her pick up whatever she wants cc gucci he gonna take up whatever she wants she piss me off so i just think it whatever she wants talking about a nigga from the nilla as a home hit it in the shop man and tell me what she wants like I'm singing, Miss, I made her tell me what she wants. <laughs> she on a pie trip again. I know power got me buying again. Friends ain't jacking me, you must be lying to your friends. They don't want my visa with the giants up again. <laughs> Shining once again. Ran it up, I told her mama, shot in my DMs. I'm <laughs> right back in. So when I hit it, sound like fuck a head Gotta ass again. Then she got it tripping off another yet again. Got a nigga feeling like a sucker yet again. Close on my emotions, then I rush and let her in. Keep on the same When we get high, when we break down. We will just watch you from the same town. But that don't change when I break What's up guys? I am home. What time is it? It is 1.38. I plan to go to Toast Noir at 2 o'clock so that way I can fill some content. I do have to go get a package, another package from the post office, from post office, from the Luxar box. And yeah, I'm just chilling today. It is something I want to talk to you guys about, but let me go to get my package first and I'll come back. All right, so I, lo I don't know if you guys remember, I told y'all recently that I was working with a brand. I actually signed a contract to work with this brand. And um, I, basically I've noticed that other creatives that are on board as well because I follow a few of them. And I was so like happy to see other people who look like me and do the same things I do. And as creative as I am, just their way and I do it my way in the same group. By the way, I'm putting on a simple black outfit. I don't even, I don't know if I'm really gonna vlog me as much. I'm more so vlogging the cafe, but besides the point. Um, yeah, I seen that they were receiving products. So I'm just like, you know, we pretty much all do the same exact thing. 
why am I not on board for this? So I reached out and I was like, hey, you know, I see that, you know, some of the other creatives are getting some items that I feel like that will be suitable for what I do. And she was like, basically, we'll reach out when we feel like something suits you. And I'm just like, okay, because fragrance and skincare don't suit me and makeup. Like I done did all, I do all three of those. I may not wear makeup as much, but to see like, I don't know, I'm a little, like it's hard not to compare myself. Not in the sense of like, oh my God, this, 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 but in a sense of like, hey, you know, I want my opportunity too. I did this so that way I'll be able to expand my platform, to get better, to grow creatively, to, to broaden my spectrum. And I don't feel like I'm achieving that when you're not giving me the opportunity after you ask me to, so I don't know. I just realized I put on the wrong shirt. <laughs> And I actually wanted to wear another shirt, but I can't find it. So I gotta find that shirt. Oh, I found it. So this is actually the shirt that I want to wear because I feel like it matches the restaurant, but I also don't know if I really wanna wear and waste it yet because I haven't worn it yet and I actually wanna wear it. Oh. Okay, so I think I do wanna wear this shirt, but I need to iron it really quick. But yeah, I feel like it basically sucks because I want to expand my platform. I wanna grow creatively and I want to collaborate with others and I feel like I'm being stripped of that opportunity because it hasn't been given to me yet but it's like you're hanging it over my head but just give it to me it's also annoying because I fight my anxiety I fight my depression I fight my urge to feel like I have to be perfect by trying to keep up with some of the trends not really but keep up some with doing with some of the things y'all want us to do and now I don't get the opportunity to so it's like in my head I wrote down some ideas of things that I wanted to do and then I wrote some in my phone and <sighs> whatever because I have been feeling lately like I've been insecure with some of my content and I've been like trying my best to like fight that like I I've been feeling like I've been doing something wrong or I just haven't been doing something right and <laughs> It's just tough with the algorithm and then having a digital manager and then mm, it's just not a good feeling when you kind of feel like you're not doing enough. But the fact that I am still standing, I am still trying is proof that I am strong and I'm going to stay in this game even if it hurts. All right, let me get dressed because I got to go. In true traditional, me being me, um, me also being Fat Ma, I got something on my shirt. I am so over it. I just put this shirt on literally an hour ago. <sighs> I, I am livid. Like, Anyways, I went to a tasting at Cafe Toast Noir. Amazing, great drinks, great vibes. Love the place. And I'm not saying that because <laughs> I know the owners and I work for them and it's right next to my job. I'm saying it because I really do appreciate it. Great concept. Love the tasting. I'm so grateful that you guys invited Trash Talks out. <laughs> coffee. The coffee in that with that teddy bear. The, first of all, that bear is just, it's so stinking cute. I bit his ear off. <laughs> yeah. So if you're ever in Atlanta and you want to stop by a Toast on Lennox, you also can stop by a Toast Noir, which is a black-owned cafe. Um, but yeah, I have some packages to open. <laughs> lots and lots and lots of packages. Well, not lots, but lots. Mm, let's get into it. Should we do slow-mo? I love slow-mo. I feel like slow-mo just... Eats. Nom 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 nom. I feel. Although I'm going this fast, this is what I feel from slow mo. Should I 
Should I do it in here or should I do it out there? Mm, I'm just gonna give you guys a synopsis of... Okay, I'm gonna do a slow-mo. What am I gonna do? I'm so excited. I'm gonna give you guys an idea from the packaging and you'll, you'll, you'll get it from there. Let's go.